Take a moment, see yourself sitting here, close your eyes, make yourself comfortable. Take a deep breath in and out, in and out. See yourself as if you're a tree. We're going to take our roots, and we're going to grow them down through the floor, down through the basements, down deep into the earth around the rocks and boulders until we reach bedrock far, far below. And we'll search around the bedrock to try to find the cool, crisp pools of water, waters of chaos, the waters of inspiration far beneath the earth. With each and every breath, once we find these pools, we'll start bringing these waters up and into our bodies up into our feet and into our legs. Next breath, bring them up into our loins and into our bellies, filling ourselves full of these cool, crisp waters from far below. Bring them up into our chests, into our heads. Then with each and every breath from here on out, comes up, flows throughout our bodies, out our heads and our hands and back into the earth. Feel these cool waters running throughout our bodies, filling us with the energy from below, filling us with the powers of creation, filling us with the powers, the waters. <sighs> Suck in these waters, embrace these waters. And now we're going to reach up into the skies with our branches up through the roofs, and our ceilings, up through the clouds until we can find that one star directly above our heads. We'll reach up, we'll start pulling down the fires from above, the, the light from above, the powers of order. We bring them down, down into our hands and into our heads. With each and every breath we bring these, this light down further into our chests and into our bellies, bring it lights down into our loins and into our legs. With each and every breath that fires and the lights come down, down to our feet and out the bottom like the waters. Feel the waters from below and the lights from above, fires from above, waters below mixing throughout our bodies filling us with the energies of order and chaos, powers of creation coursing throughout our bodies. Take in these powers, hold on to what we need, embrace them, bring ourselves back to our center. When you're ready, take the waters, the excess waters and push them out. Take the excess fires and push them out. Disconnect and know that if you ever need to pull on any of these powers, you can always reach down and reach up and pull them into yourselves. But for now, take a deep breath in and out, in and out. When you're ready, open your eyes and join us ready for magic. Earth Mother, you surround us and you support us. You aid us and you guide us. You give us food, give us shelter. For everything that you do, Earth Mother, accept our offerings. We're here to honor the kindred, and we're here to ask for their blessings in return. First, let us hallow our hallows. Mighty well, you run deep, deep into the earth to where the world tree can drink of you and our ancestors reside. We give you the silver. We say sacred waters flow within us. mighty fire. You burn and you consume. 
you send our offerings high into the sky to the shining ones far above. We offer you this incense. You see sacred fires burn within us. A mighty tree, your roots go far below the worlds of the ancestors. Your branches go high to the sky, to the worlds of the shining ones. We sense you, we spurge you. We say, sacred tree, grow within us. In my house and in all of our houses, by the might of the water, the light of the fire, our groves are made whole and holy. By the might of the water, the light of the fire, our groves are made whole and holy. By the might of the water, the light of the fire, our groves are made whole and holy. So be it. Next, we call to the gatekeepers. Gatekeepers all, you have aided us and guided us throughout the years. We call to you once more to aid us. Watch over us as we walk your holy ways. Take our messages far and wide. Bring back to us what we need to hear. Protect us as we do our works. Gatekeepers, accept our offerings. Now, gatekeepers, in my house and in all of our houses, do your magic with mine and let all of our wells open. It's a gate to the underworld. Let all of our fires open. It's a gate to the upper worlds. Let all of our trees be the crossroads between all the worlds, open to our voices and open to our spirits. Let the gates be open. Shining ones, gods and goddesses of our days, you who watch over each and every one of us, our patrons and matrons, we offer you welcome. Those of you of this very land where we sit, we offer you welcome. To all those who are unknown to us, but watch over us anyway, we offer you welcome. We ask you to come join us by our fires. Shining ones, Accept our offerings. Land spirits, you fur and feather, scale and skin, our animal kin, we offer you welcome. You leaf and twig, stem and flower, our plant kin, we offer you welcome. And be you the unseen, the house spirits, the land spirits, we offer you welcome. Come. Join us by our fires. Land spirits, accept our offering. And finally, the ancestors. To all of you of our bloodlines, those who have come before us, we offer you welcome. To all of you who we look up to, our mentors, our inspiration, we offer you welcome. And to all of you in this very earth, those who are here before us, we offer you welcome. Come and join us by our fires. Ancestors, accept our offerings. At this moment, if you have offerings of your own to make, please make them. What is best come to be? There are no further offerings. Ancient and mighty ones, we have given to you. We give you one more time and we ask for your blessings and returns. Mighty kindred, accept our sacrifice. And mighty kindred, we ask what blessings 
until you bestow upon us. Shining ones, what blessings do you give us? Give us Esau. Kind of ironic since it's snowing outside here. Esau stands for ice. It's that nature. Land spirits, what blessings do you give us? Give us so as of the sun and fullness. Hey, ancestors, what blessings do you give us? As Elhas, protection, the outsets. We've got fire and we've got water here. We've got protection. I think they're talking about time of bounce, that they have our backs. But practice that balance between sun and ice, fire and water. I think these omens are good. We accept these omens. Ancient and mighty ones, we have given to you, and we ask in good Gossi tradition that you return these blessings to us. Fill our waters, my waters and those of everyone here. Fill them with the ether, the ice, and waters of nature. Fill them with sozo, the sun and heat of the heavens. Fill with Elha's protection of our ancestors. Behold our, the waters of life. Now, let's thank all of those that they gave us. Ancestors, you have come before us, you who we choose, and those of this very land. For all that you do for us throughout the days, and all you've done for us in this right. Ancestors, we thank you. Land spirits, be you the animal kin, be you the plant kin, or be you the unseen kin. For all that you do for us throughout the days and all you've done for us throughout this right. Man spirits, we thank you. And to the shining ones, be you our patrons and matrons, be you of this very land, or be you unknown to us. For all that you do throughout the days and all you do for us throughout this right. Shining ones, we thank you. And gatekeeper, once more you have aided us. You have opened the ways, took our messages far and wide, brought back what we needed to hear. For all that you have done for us throughout the years, and all you've done, done for us tonight. Gatekeepers, we thank you. Now, yes, join your magic once more of mine, in my house and in all of our houses. Let the wells become but water. The fires become but flame, but the trees become but a tree once more. Let the gates be closed. To the earth mother, you surround us, you support us, you feed us, you shelter us. You do so much for us that we honor you first and we thank you last for all that you do for us. Earth Mother, we thank you. And go now, children of Earth, and listen in peace. The right has ended.